It's a matter of pride that the uh, Department of Physics today is celebrating a National Science Day of 2024 to commemorate uh, uh, the Nobel Laureate, Sir C.V. Raman. C.V. Raman was an Indian physicist known for his work in the field of light, as was uh, uh, brilliantly exposed by Wadi Sahib. Uh, the light scattering, when light passes through a medium and what happens to it, which finally uh, came to be known as the Raman effect. Raman, in his uh, broadening venture on optics, started to investigate scattering of light very early in 1990. His first phenomenal discovery of physics of light was the basis of blue color of uh, the sea water. That's why he uh, started working when he went to England. And on 18, 28 February 1928, that is today, using a very simple tool, a pocket size spectroscope and a, a prism in hand. So there's not too much of uh, uh, material he had. He bought it for, I think, 200 rupees. He, along with his colleague, who is very important, Krishna, he probably was instrumental in his uh, work and probably should have also got a Nobel Prize. Basically, the aim of our meeting on this day is to commemorate and to have a deep idea about this great science science is bringing to life in education, in scientific temperament and career and in discoveries. It is a matter of great pleasure that I give the introduction of our honorable director, N.I.T. Srinagar, Professor Ravindana. Professor Ravindana, a fellow Institute of Genius, fellow Telangana Academy of Science, is presently serving as Vice Chancellor, Central University of Kashmir, and Officiating Director in Atishri Why we do celebrate these special days? The reason is to draw certainly some motivation and inspiration, especially. So these two speakers has given necessary output. How you have to make an input for the big city, Bharat. Though being a social science man, the Arab Kumar has clearly detailed about what is the vision of the country and where we should head it. And present government, what extent the new policies and frameworks is bringing. The quality when it comes, there are five important things are there, research quality. One is how publications, the quality publication with high impact factor, you are able to do. Then how we are able to get good innovative projects funded by different agencies, whether industry or any other funding agency. Thirdly, how you can translate this into patentable versions. And fourthly, how you can make the partnerships, collaborations with the others. And fifthly, it is the practices, the best practices, ethical practices which is being mentioned. So, research ethics is one of the important. So, this is a mythology already recorded something, Indian mythology. Even the, every, any other things, if you take Bhaskara and Aryabhata. So, those are the people who are Indian mathematicians, astronomers who made these things. And latest also Ramanuja mathematician, how he is contributed to the mathematics field. So, you, Raman is also one of them. So, the, you have to, ancient to golden days, Charaka, and Shushruta and in social sciences, politics and economics, this is Chanakya or Kautilya we say. So all those stories if you try to learn, you will be able to know. And moreover, the Kashmir itself is a seat of knowledge and learning. Make this as a center of knowledge. And thank you for giving me this opportunity. And I wish you all the best in your future endeavors and go out from this ship to flying colors. In Dinuki Ahmiat or in Dinuki Khususiat, 
इस बात से लगाई जाती है कि हमारे सर सी वी रमन साहब फर्स्ट इंडियन फिजिसिस्ट थे जिन्हें नोबल प्राइज से नवाजा गया फर्स्ट एंड द ब्यूटी ऑफ द प्राइज वॉज दैट ही स्टडीड इन इंडिया एंड हैव रिसीव नोबल प्राइज फॉर हिज नॉवल वर्क हम उतने ही ब्राइट नहीं हो सकते हैं जितने सी वी रमन साहब थे लेकिन हम उस का काम है कि बच्चों को हम क्रिएटिविटी क्यूरियस एंड इनक्यूजिटिव बना सकते हैं एंड इन्फ्यूज साइंटिफिक टेम्पर डाल सकते हैं रही बात आज के दिन के इम्पोर्टेंस या नए फील्ड्स के बारे में बहुत पहले पहले हमने जो है कदम डाला था अपनी लेबॉर्ट्रीज से लैंड पे तो हमारे पास एग्रीकल्चर है वी हैव एन एफ एग्रीकल्चर वी मूव फ्राम लैब टू लैंड वेरी रिसेंटली वी मूव फ्राम लैब टू मून वेर इन वी हैव लैंड इट चंद्रयान थ्री हमने लैंड कराया ऑन साउथ पोल ऑफ द मून एंड इंडिया इज द फर्स्ट कंट्री टू अचीव दिस ऑनर एंड फीट इन बच्चों को अगर हम इंस्पायर कराए अगर हम इन्हें थोड़ा सा ही इन चीजों के बारे में अलम दें मुझे यकीन कामिल है कि ये लोग सारे उन फील्ड्स में जिनका आजकल खोप है लोगों को इंक्लूडिंग आर्टिफिशियल इंटेलिजेंस नॉलेज इंजीनियरिंग रोबोटिक्स मशीन लर्निंग ये उनमें तमाम में सबकत पाएंगे प्रोवाइडेड दे वर्क प्रोवाइड इनको इसीलिए लाया था हमने इंस्पायर करने के लिए कि ये बच्चे जो हैं इन अजीम शख्सियतों का जो है स्पीच सुने और इन अजीम शख्सियतों के बारे में सुने कि उन्होंने कैसा काम किया है आज के दिन के आज के दिन का जो है इट बिकम फंडामेंटल ऑब्जेक्टिव ऑफ दिस डे टू इनवाइट पीपल फ्रॉम अदर पार्ट्स मैं प्रोफेसर सिमी रुबाब हूँ मैं यहाँ फिजिक्स डिपार्टमेंट में काम करती हूँ और ये जो नेशनल साइंस डे है ये जैसा कि आज सब कोई जानते हैं कि सी वी रमन को नोबेल प्राइज मिला था उसके याद में मनाया जाता है लेकिन इसका असल मकसद ये है कि साइंस को पॉपुलर बनाना लोगों आम लोगों तक पहुंचाना लोगों को लगता है कि साइंस जो है एक बड़ी उसको पढ़ने के लिए कुछ अलग से लोग चाहिए और जो साइंटिस्ट लोग होते हैं वो किसी ख़ास पेडेस्टल पर होते हैं तो ये जो हमारी नई जनरेशन के तलबा तलबात हैं उनको बताने के लिए कि नहीं साइंस बहुत इंटरेस्टिंग है और ज़िंदगी के तमाम शोबों में इसकी अहमियत है मुल्क की तरक्की के लिए इसकी अहमियत है और ख़ास तौर से जो इस साल का थीम है वो है इंडिजीनस टेक्नोलॉजी इंडिजीनस टेक्नोलॉजी के बारे में थीम है तो इंडिजीनस टेक्नोलॉजी जो है किसी मकाम की जो ख़ास उस इलाके की ज़रूरियात के लिए टेक्नोलॉजी होती है जैसे यहाँ पर अभी मौसम सरमा है तो यहाँ पर कश्मीर की जो इंडिजीनस टेक्नोलॉजी है जो आजकल बहुत सारे चीज़ हीटिंग के लिए आ गए लेकिन नथिंग कैन बीट कांगरी नथिंग कैन बीट हमाम हम इलेक्ट्रिकल हमाम बनाते हैं लेकिन जो ट्रेडिशनल हमाम थे तो आज का दिन का मकसद यही है जो थीम इस साल का है कि इंडिजिनस टेक्नोलॉजी को यानी इलाकई टेक्नोलॉजी को बढ़ावा दिया जाए We got to know a lot about Sir C. V. Raman, an Indian physicist, and about National Science Day, and it was really informative, and we enjoyed a lot at the same time. These programs are a necessity as they motivate a person. They motivate and inspire all of us, and they are absolutely a necessity. Today we enjoyed a lot here in the NIT National Institute of Technology, Srinagar. It was really fun, and we got to know about C. V. Raman and National Science Day. It was pretty informative and. we really enjoyed it as we all know that india is celebrating national science day on 28th of february so i think these programs are really important for us for our young minds to get the experience to know about science and technology how cb raman sir has helped us what important discoveries he made in the uh, field of science and technology so i think these programs are really very important for us 
Well, I think this was an amazing experience. Like uh, there were the speeches of different prof professors. So we got to know about many things that we weren't uh, known of. We came to know about the discovery of C. sir importantly, like how they started and how we can develop uh, our mind in the field of research, how we can do uh, the things in our way to think about the things and how we can innovate, how we can inv invent and how can we get a product out of it. So it was really an amazing uh, well, uh, this is Sufina uh, representing Education Department, uh, Jammu and Kashmir. Well, today, NIT Srinagar took an opportunity to celebrate the National Science Day on uh, 28th Feb 2024. And I guess it was a grandiose event conducted under the pragmatic leadership of uh, Professor Ami Shasa. Uh, I guess, uh, like, uh, while uh, listening to the uh, plenary uh, lectures and uh, uh, informative lectures uh, from the expertise. We ignited the spark of the curiosity and embraced the wonders of the science. I guess uh, it was actually the celebration of the spirit of the curiosity, discovery and innovation. And uh, definitely the absolute aim of celebrating such events is to honor the scientists, the thinkers, uh, and all of the like, uh, science-linked personalities uh, who shaped our understanding of uh, the world. So happy Science Day and uh, keep growing on.